Hey, what's up you guys? If you're gonna to be towing with your Subaru Crosstrek, you have to have trailer wiring installed on your vehicle. Lucky for us, Subaru did a great job in prepping the vehicle for towing. Let me show you how easy this wiring is to install. You will need the tool seam here to complete this installation. Just gonna open up the back door here and we're gonna remove this flooring. Okay, we got the flooring removed. Now we'll remove the two foam pads. That is the uh, foundation for the flooring. They are held in by one little panel clip right here. And you can just simply take a screwdriver or panel tool and pry it up. Just like that. Come right out for you. Okay, now that we have the foam pads removed, we can go ahead and take our center panel off. And to do that, there is a panel clip here and one here. I've already removed that for you so I can take away some of the mystery of how it comes out. So basically it's a push pin connector. This is the center portion that pushes into the base portion here. To take the panel clip out, you just simply take the top uh, push pin and pull it back and then the whole piece will come out. We'll do that over here on the driver's side. Again, we're gonna be using a panel tool, a little hook on the edge. To get it right behind there, we're just gonna work it back and forth a little bit. Just like that. Now we can pull the rest of the way out. Okay. Now that we have the two clips removed, the center panel just simply pulls straight up and it is held in place by these clips here. So when you're done, you just line it up with the holes, push it back down and it'll go clip right into place. We'll go ahead and set this aside. Okay, and with our center panel removed, the uh, factory OEM tow package or tow harness is right here. And all you gotta do is just reach your hand in there, grab it and pull it straight out. And then the uh, aftermarket wiring harness just plugs right into that. Let me go ahead and give you a look at what it looks like inside here. Okay, I'm just gonna pull this harness back a little bit and you can see the white clip down in there. And we're just gonna simply just grab it and pull on it and uh, it'll come right out for us. Okay, so I've got our product out here. Um, I'll, I'll unravel it here and show you what we've got. This is gonna be the single plug that plugs into our tow package back here. Um, this is our ground wire. We'll go ahead and make our ground to our body here. And then this is our uh, inline fuse holder. Um, and we'll go ahead and put a fuse in there that's provided by the manufacturer. And then last, we have our four flat connection here. That's what plugs into your trailer. So the manufacturer gives you quite a bit of hardware in their packaging. Um, several zip ties and, and connectors that, that you really don't need. All you really need out of this packaging is going to be the uh, provided 10 amp fuse that goes in your inline fuse holder and then our ground screw here. So we'll go ahead and prep it by putting in the 10 amp fuse into the fuse holder. Just like that, put the cap over it. It's ready to go. Now we'll go ahead and make our ground connection. We're going to take the screw, just put it right through here. And we'll take a quarter inch drive and we'll put it right to the body here. All right, we have our ground screw set. And the last thing we need to do is just plug it in. So um, we're gonna just reach behind here, grab this harness and just kind of tug on it a little bit and reach under and grab our plug, which is right here. And then we're gonna take the aftermarket plug and just simply plug it right in and it snaps right into place, just like that. 
and now our tow harness is activated. So now we can just go ahead and tuck everything under here and put the flooring back in and we'll show you how the four flat works. Okay, so we have all of our paneling back in and our flooring. Um, we'll just kind of show you how to operate it when you're ready to tow. Just unfold your floor there. Take your stowed floor flat out. You've got about three feet of wiring here. Basically, when you're ready to use it, you'll just pull it out, lay it over the weather stripping here, and go ahead and just shut the door over that. Okay, now I'll go ahead and open the door again and just show you that uh, there is no damage to the wiring when you shut the door. This is where it went over the, the weather stripping here. And you can see there's a lot of give to it. It'll just compress right into it. And then when you're not using the wiring harness, you can go ahead and just fold it back up and stow it uh, next to your spare tire here. Okay, and that'll do it for our trailer wiring video for the Subaru Crosstrek. Thank you for watching our video. Have fun and be safe. To learn more about the products seen in this video or to schedule an installation by U-Haul Hitch Professional, visit us online today at uhaulhitches.com.